Tether. I am without my partner right now. She went off to work. And so we're gonna do two different videos separately. Uh, we're gonna do the 25 question um, and facts, random facts about us. And so we wanted to kind of just give you some random facts just so that you can kind of get to know us. My hair is like so unruly right now. Like I was, I took a bath last night, washed my hair and I was like, okay, I'm going to air dry it because I'm too lazy. I'm not going to dry it, blow dry it. I should have blow dried it because it's like, it's going a little crazy. So anyways, so, um, question number one, what is my nickname? It's either Hedo, babe, baby, header. Um, I think those are pretty much my nicknames. Uh, what color are my eyes? My eyes are hazel. They're like a brown and green mixture. It's really pretty, especially in the sunlight. Not to boast about my own eyes, but, um, when's my birthday? My birthday is September 12th and it's kind of crazy because, um, her birthday is on September 16th and we're six years and four days apart. Kind of crazy. So, uh, what's my favorite drink? My favorite drink is a soy chai tea latte. And if it's an alcoholic drink, it's an amaretto sour. Love me some amaretto sours. I get in big trouble with those. So, what is your favorite song at the moment? Currently, it's meant to be by BB Rexa and um, Florida Georgia Line. I think I said her name right. If I did, I'm sorry. Um, I like that like like that song right now because it's um you know we've been falling on a little bit of hard times uh, mo monetarily we just moved into this apartment last month so um and then Kristen trying to um look for a, a better job that will give her full-time hours uh you know it's it that song really just puts me in that place like not to stress out and just relax if it's meant to be it'll be um, what's your favorite food? Lobster or fondue? Yes, I'm one of those babes. High maintenance babe. No, I'm not high maintenance. But I like really good lobster or uh, fondue. I like all kinds of fish and seafood. Um, lobster, oh my gosh. You put lobster right in front of me. I'll be drooling. <laughs> uh, what's the last thing we bought? Well, I... I was gonna say groceries because I have my answers here, but we actually bought some stuff at Walgreens and we're gonna do a uh, an affordable haul, like it's a mini haul from Walgreens and we're gonna do that next, either next video or then one, next one after that. So I think she's gonna do her 25 question fact, random facts. Um, favorite book of all time, it's The Help by Catherine Stockett. I love that movie and I was like, I'm going to read the book because usually the book is so much better than the movie and um, fun, fun, another fun fact is when I was um, a little girl in the 80s, I, I begged my grandmother to uh, make me a poodle skirt because I wanted to be in the 50s. Like I watched Grease all the time and I wanted to be in the 50s and I, I begged her to make me one for Halloween one year and she made me one and had the poodle and little pearls and little I still remember that skirt so grandma if you're watching I love you so much for making that for me because that's like one of my pivotal child childhood moments that I just I adore I love the 50s and stuff um, but this was you know the help was based on the 50s and 60s and um, just that time it's a crazy time and I'm so thankful that things are hopefully a lot better right now than it was then um, so, but it's, it's one of my favorite books and movies. Uh, what's my favorite color? Purple and teal or purple and mint, mint green. I can't decide, but definitely purple. Uh, how many pets do we have? I have, we have, um, Audrey and Harper. Harper is my Siamese and, um, Audrey is her daughter and she's a, half Maine Coon, half Siamese, because the father, his name is Max, he was a Maine Coon. So she got her body from her daddy. So, um, yeah, she's, she's my little fluff ball, but mama's, she's, 
we call her Mamas or Harper. Harper is her name, but we call her Mamas because she's such a good mom, mama to her kitties. She was, oh my gosh, she's such, such a good mama. Just making sure they're, they're getting enough to eat and, you know, um, just, she's just wonderful mamas. Um, so yeah, that's the two we have. We did have Toby, um, but my ex has him right now. So I do try to go see him at least once a month or once every other month. Lately, it's been once a month. Cause I do miss him. He's my baby. Uh, so we're doing that. Uh, what's my favorite perfume? Ralph Lauren's Romance is a really good one. I've, I think it's a classic one because that was from um, late 2000s, early, like late 90s, early 2000s. I'm sorry. I think that, but it's, it's a really good um, perfume and I always get compliments when I'm wearing it. Always. Uh, favorite holiday, Jesus' birthday and Christmas. Um, I just feel that, you know, Jesus is the reason for the season, but also everybody gets a little bit more kinder and, you know, they pay it forward here and there. And it's just a wonderful thing to see. And I, I just wish that the whole world could, you know, pay it for, forward other than Jesus' birthday or Christmas. So, but... That's the reason why I like that holiday is because it's his birthday and they just, you know, everybody just gets a little bit kinder. Most everybody. There are some people that can be a little crazy during the shopping holiday, so. Um, am I ma married? No, I'm divorced. I was married for eight years together with Alan for 10 and uh, we just got divorced end of February. That was finalized end of February. Uh, have you ever been on the country? If so, how many times? Yes, twice on cruises. So I've been to Mahogany uh, Bay, uh, Jamaica, uh, Honduras, Belize. I don't recommend going to Honduras. Belize or Jamaica is the way to go. And I've been to Cozumel, 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 a uh, couple times. And that was on two different cruises. Uh, so much fun. If you want to like go out and travel for the first time and you don't want to spend bukus of money, get on a cruise for two people. It's like anywhere from $1,100 to $1,200 and that includes food, tax, and tips I believe. It depends on the peak season. Uh, let's see. Do you speak any uh, languages? No, I don't, but I can sign in uh, ABC, like ABCs in uh, sign language. Uh, because my, um, I had a friend in, in high school who was deaf and uh, she showed me how to do the ABCs and then my Aunt Sydney knew the ABCs and she showed me how to do that. So that's always just kind of stuck with me. I wish I could l learn a little bit more sign language because I'm hearing impaired myself. So, but I just haven't had the time to do it. Um, how many siblings do you have? I have one sister and then I have one brother. He's like a half brother, but he's still my brother. And then I have two step brothers. They're still my brothers. They're just, so I'm the oldest. Uh, what's my favorite shop? It's either Marshall's or Ross. And if it's for beauty, it's gonna be Sephora or Ulta, but mainly Sephora because Ulta, for some reason, I just can't find anything I want unless I have to order it online. And I hate ordering it online through Ulta. I don't know why. So, uh, let's see. Oh, what's my favorite restaurant? Red Lobster or Melting Pot? Melting Pot is awesome. If you go with a, a group of friends or with your loved one, it's very expensive. So, uh, you know, make sure you have enough money to take care of like the whole bill or, you know, half the bill or whatever. But it's, it's, you could do different courses for Melting Pot and they, they bring all this food to you and they show you how to cook it. And there's like shrimp, lobster, steak, chicken, uh, I don't think there's salmon. There's, um, one time there's a fish there and it's like a bula base, bula base. And so, uh, they have the cooking styles, like cook all then, um, and then they have a, a cheese fondue. You could do beer and cheese. You could do the Swiss, uh, the cheese trio, which has Swiss and Gouda and something else. 
in white cheddar, I think it is. And then you can definitely do the dessert. The dessert is the most awesomest part. And they give you cheesecake and Rice Krispies, bananas, pound cake, strawberries, anything you can think of that you can dip into chocolate that just makes it so much better. Yeah, I'm gonna go there every day. I wish, I wish I could go there every day, but yeah, I would be so fat. <laughs> Um, my favorite blog is my girlfriend's blog, and it's, um, yeah, I'm a little, like, prejudiced. Uh, it's Y Squared, and I will link down the, um, the link below. She, she writes so eloquently, and she loves to write. I'm, like, I like to write, but my thing is, like, um, you know, like, just video or, uh, FaceTime, live videos on Facebook, you know, that type of thing. I'm more like on hand person in front of you type thing. Uh, but she loves to write and she does a wonderful job on her blog. I love it. Um, favorite movie is Guardians of the Galaxy, one and two. I cannot choose between one and two because I love them both. And I love Groot. And I'm a, um, I have got a ring ringtone that says, I am Groot. And I just, I love it. I love it. And I even got Kristen into to watching it. First she was watching it, she was just like, no. And I'm like, no, 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 you, you need to watch it. And so um, she watched it. She's like, okay, I need to see the second one. And uh, we saw the second one. She's like, oh my gosh, the little Groot, he's so cute. And uh, it, it's just my favorite, favorite two movies. Um, my favorite t TV show right now is Timeless. I've been watching it since it came out last year and I am addicted to time travel type things and uh, that kind of thing. Like, that's a wonderful show. There was another show that came out um, that was something to the effect, but it got canceled. Timeless, it's just like, it, I don't know, it just pulls everything together. The storyline's wonderful, the plot, you know, it, it always keeps you guessing. I love it, I love it. Um, PC or Mac? We currently have a PC, but we would like to get a Mac whenever we get established with um, Kristen's job. So hopefully we'll get a Mac in the near future. Uh, what phone do I have? I have a um, black iPhone 8. Of course, I'm going to show you this. If you don't know what these are, these are called love handles and they're on Amazon. I will put the, the link down below for you guys to check it out because I never, it never falls. And this phone is so freaking heavy. And I can just sit here and watch a movie with, with my phone and it doesn't fall. Like I can even take this into the tub and it doesn't fall. Like Kristen, Kristen saw that, she's like, what is that? And I'm like, it's called the love handle. You have to get it. It's only like $7, I think. Seven to $10, depending on what style you get. Um, the different styles, they do have a bunch of different styles, um, but it's totally worth it. And I would recommend putting it up closer. I don't know why I put it down down below, but I would recommend it putting it right in the center of the phone. It's an awesome, awesome thing to have on your phone. How tall am I? I'm six feet tall. I'm very tall. Um, I come from a family that's tall. My dad is 5'11", my mom is 5'10", um, but yeah, I'm, I'm about six feet. I may be shrinking. I'm not sure yet. I haven't checked because I am getting old. <laughs> and can you cook? Yes, I love to cook. And I cook all the time. I just made um, pot roast today with carrots, onions, and celery. And uh, it was really good. And um, yes, I love to cook. I will cook all day, any day. Give me some stuff and I'll make it. Um, I do have like um, friends love to come over to eat my meals and stuff like that and like I have a particular friend his name is David and uh, he'll, he'll always ask me can you make your ham loaf and cock pot corn and I'm like okay well so this ham loaf that I get it's from um, Kansas City Missouri and it's a mixture of lamb veal and ham and um, it's kind of got a sweet glaze over it. It's so good. Anytime I make it, like especially the men in my family, it's gone. Like I don't have leftovers, don't have it. 
It's awesome. Um, if you are interested in the ham loaf recipe, let me down below. Um, let me down below. Leave me a comment down below, and um, I can um, give you the name. Well, the name of the shop that makes the ham loaf mix is McGonagways. McGonagways. And I can get that information for y'all if y'all want the recipe and where to buy it because they do send packages and I think it's like freezed in freezed um, airtight packages so you get it fresh I believe I've never had it shipped I've always gone to Kansas City because my grandmother lives in Kansas City so Kansas City uh, actually Overland Park Kansas but uh, anytime we go it's just like 40 minutes to just get over to Kansas City Missouri because we like to check out uh, the stuff over there, like the Union Station and stuff like that, where my grandpa was sh uh, shipped off to war. Um, I don't know which war it was. I can't remember. But um, I go over there to pay my, res my respects to my grandpa, and, and on the way there is that shop. It's McGonagley's. Yeah, McGonagley's. So uh, let me know if you want that recipe. I will definitely share that with y'all. And um, that is my 25 question random facts about me and a little bit of few extra. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe. Make sure you subscribe to our tribe um, and share with your friends and family so that we know that you care. Thank you so much for tuning in and hanging out with me. I had a blast, and hopefully we can do a little bit more of these, hopefully together with Kristen, because I miss her. Shout out to you, boo. I know she'll be watching this tonight. Anyways, um, love you guys, and we will talk to you later. Bye!